D-Lobby is our capstone project where we test the design principles of our 10 weeks of need finding and prototyping. In this event, we are testing to see if our 21 to 35 year old demographic will show up and how best to create a crowd forming situation where time becomes fluid, the audience can show up at any time and not miss the show, and where last minute attendance is always possible. The event must take on a self-promoting life of its own and create a digital presence that outlives the event itself. Walking through that door just seemed like a dream. I actually think this is an amazing idea for a theater. When people show up, it should already be going. Like you're just joining a continuous party. running a series of prototypes all summer and working towards developing some design principles about theater, which we're testing here tonight, and just really looking at what they're interested in doing while they're here. Are they doing something from the last five years? Do you want to go see it? No, like seriously, almost the entire thing is playing. Did the play itself change for you, seeing it in this kind of a venue, or...? Yeah, I think it's so close. Yeah, like, the actors would stare at you while they were singing. Are you going to stick around to see some yeah, other yeah. theaters? Yeah? Watch the circus. You're going to go yeah. see a circus? Yeah. Alright, cool. Perception theater in the modern world is just very outdated. There needs to be some sort of change where you're combining today's world and the old world. I think it's interesting that it's happening. Like right now I'm talking to you and not listening to her and that feels weird to me. The more you learn about the process, the more you can appreciate it. So the more theaters you go to, the more you know about it. I feel like we don't get enough of this vibe on campus. It's amazing just to go and party and then get to watch theater and circus acts. It's just amazing. It's not necessarily bad, it's just weird.